hi people welcome back to my channel it's a beautiful day today so i'm outside you may hear some minor noises but please ignore it so the last time i did a video about how i wash my hair in twist to reduce shrinkage this is the end result um i untwisted it the next day and this is how it look but i'll be doing some braids very soon so i needed to stretch my hair so today's video is about how i stretch my hair I use the hairbrush, the bigger comb, and the small comb. I also use the hair thread, of course, and then I use the shea butter. I melted it, so this is the natural shea butter from Ghana. So, the extent at which your hair can be stretched will depend on the partition you make. So, if you want your hair to be really stretched, then you look out for patting your hair into smaller sections. But if you are in a hurry and you don't have time for that, then you can pat it into um, larger sections. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to part my hair into eight different parts and I'm going to thread it. Please notice how I comb my hair. So I start by combing from the tip to the base because I believe it uh, reduces um, hair breakage. Next, I'm going to spray some water in it. going to apply the shea butter because I think that shea butter makes my hair very soft so I'm going to apply that I'm gonna use the hairbrush so now I'm going to thread the hair I make sure that the base is very tight and I do that because I want to make sure that the base is also uh, stretched enough. But don't make it as tight such that it hurt. Okay, so as I'm threading, make sure that I do. No, this comb is better. I make sure that I brush as I thread. And then I use the smaller comb because usually I find that the tips, the tip of our hair is the most uh, shrink. Then I tighten the tip. So I'm going to do the same thing for the rest. Okay guys, so I am all done. I'm going to leave it on overnight and I will unthread it tomorrow to see the end result. So because I'll be going to bed soon, I'm just going to wrap the hair around. So I'm about to release the thread. Let's see the end result. So this is how my hair looks after on threading. So why do you have to always use a straightener to straighten your hair? The heat is not healthy for your hair. So please try the threading and see how it works for you. I don't think it depends on your hair texture, no. So please try it and let me know at the comment section below. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe. See you in my next video. Bye.